In this third quick start guide, we're going to create a scripted action, clone a test case, and create a new execution. Let's identify a new test case for, for us to work with. Let's go to Amazon.com as before. Now, let's search for Star Wars Blu-ray. And before we click on anything, let's actually identify a new action where we'll check or uncheck the checkbox here based on the value 1970 to 1979 and then we're gonna select the first and click on add to cart and identify that it was added in Reddit HQ let's create a new action to support that checking the checkbox first we need to create a script let's go to scripts expand SRC folder right click on actions select new and java action type in check movie tv release decade click ok and then put your code here to handle this checkbox or go to the quick start guide that comes with this video and copy paste the code we have in there to make things easier Click on Build button to validate your new action. Build is successful. And now let's do a git push so any other future user will be able to use the R script as well. We will talk more about git push and pull in the next quick start guide 4. Now let's create an action definition and tie this new action script code to it. We we'll go to Actions, click on New Action, type in Check and Check the Movie and TV show decade checkbox keep this as a script this is going to be an Amazon action so let's type in Amazon under tags and press enter add two new parameters the first one is going to be called check whether we should check or uncheck and since it's true or false we're going to keep it as boolean click update and the next parameter is going to be called date range value this is where we're going to specify what date range value we want to use. Then we we'll use a script picker to point to the script method we want to use. This looks complete, so let's mark it as automated and click on save. Now let's create a test case that will use this action. Since add Star Trek to cart is so similar, let's clone it. We opened it click on clone selected test case type in add star wars to cart and click OK we just now need to add a new action we have created between search Amazon and select item so let's open action tree Amazon and here's check and uncheck we're setting check to true and date range is going to be 1970 to 1979 and the search text is going to be not Star Trek but Star Wars Blu-ray let's make this test case more compatible with a lot of other test case executions by specifying an after state which will say close current window so it will close the current window which is going to be a browser after this test case completes so any other future test cases will not have this open window for them. The test case looks complete, so let's click on save. Now let's add this test case to the test set we have, which is Amazon Shopping, and create a brand new execution. We go to Executions, New Execution. Let's type in the name New Amazon execution select the test set of Amazon shopping set the browser you want to execute against in this case I'm going to select Firefox under settings select no after state because I want to see the browser remain open for now with my Star Wars search then check the checkbox next to localhost check the checkbox next to our add Star Wars to cart click on save button we see our execution being saved and click on run
it opens the browser goes to Amazon searches Star Wars Blu-ray checks the checkbox 1970 to 1979 selects the first one adds to cart and validates it and execution is done and finished